Hey guys, remember we put to the test not too long ago pet spa? Well, that video went crazy. It actually went trending first time on this channel. Thank you so much, guys. Well, anyways, that video got 2 million views. What does it tell me? That means people actually interested in that kind of gadget. So I actually got another different type of pet spa or pet washing station. So hopefully it will help because it's been raining here insane amount again. So the dogs absolutely always find the muddy spots or they dig out a hole. Even though I try to keep up my grass really, really full, they'll dig out the new hole and make themselves muddy. So I gotta wash them again because I love to keep my pets clean so I actually can enjoy them and snuggle them. And so that way they're not making my house mud. So this is why I always look for something to keep my pets really nice and clean. All right, let's see what I got today. This dog washing station is actually way cheaper than pet spa but is it cheaply made let's find out i really hope this one will work even better i think this one costs about 150 bucks give it or take it but if you buy like attachment like this is their legs to make it even taller i'm really tall so i bought them because i know i don't want to bend over the whole time i'm washing the dogs it's not good to be working with your back i want to work with my legs and you can also buy little steps for this thing and that's gonna cost you about 200 250 dollars i have big dogs so i bought this thing in large wow look at that this is what i'm saying you never can keep them clean they just always find a spot to make themselves a mess of anyways there is little eight step instruction hopefully it's pretty easy i'm gonna take everything out Looks like there is little legs and there's a whole bunch of little things. Obviously we're going to set up the legs and stuff together first. Okay, very easy. Wow, they get excited. Look, Hugo, come here. Okay, this way. Okay, very easy to put it in. Gus, put the bag down. Gus is like tearing the bag up. This is my bag. Give it back, go away. Give it back. Don't need the bag, it's not good for you. Are you guys excited about your new spa? So as you can see, this is not a pain to put it together. There's little clips. I love it, boom. Then I have these attachments, like a booster thing. Let's see how they go in. There you go. That gives you at least like what? Seven to 10 inches not really sure they're really excited every time i'm building something they want to help yeah you're gonna step on it go go away it's not ready for you okay now we can set it up wow that's pretty tall check this out it's almost to my waist next step we're gonna put everything just clips in very very easy I like that it's elevated, so that way the dogs won't be jumping off of it. All this attaches to the clips, and most of them have popped in. I wonder if this right here, where the hose gonna go in and... Yep, this is a drainage hose, which is nice. You can divert the water so that way you're not standing in a puddle. Look at Gus waiting on his bath. He's getting so big. He almost don't fit into that bench. Insane. Okay, now we're going to build the little things together. Okay, there's some kind of clips and stuff. And there's little bolts. I think these bolts are going to go into this pot right here. We'll find out in a little bit. But wow, nice. Look, it actually came with the strap so that way the dog's going to hang out and not run away. And they're gonna go like right here. Wow, this is nice. So that way they're not even gonna be able to jump out. But at the same time, it's not gonna hold them tight. It's gonna hold them really gently. And one right here. So like this. And this is the knobs that are holding them. Wow, this is so simple, but quality looks really good. 
Look, it even come with the color, adjustable color. And it looks like will fit my dog really easily. Also, this side here gonna go like that. And comes with a little screw. One and two right here. And in each corner. This one comes with a nozzle, but don't really connect to anything. But this spare looks cool. And looks like you can shut it off, on and off. And I love how you can clip it into here so you don't have to bend over every single time. I actually come with this adjustable leash. My dogs don't really wear leashes all the time. So we don't want to get it tight. Uh, you can get... <laughs> it's okay. You can get actually steps for your dogs. But I'm not gonna get steps. Oh, look at that. Luke is actually wanna get on it. He's getting jealous. Anyways. Gas too. Oh wow, look at that. This is very nice. It covers it all the way. This is beautiful. Good boy, good boy. Wow, this thing is insane. Nope, you wanna stay here. If you're gonna get out, if you're gonna try to get out, you can all... Oh my gosh, he getting jealous. Oh, look at him. Guys, you're gonna go next. You know it's the best part right now? Look at me. I'm standing, full force standing. I'm not bent over, I'm not hurting my back. I'm actually very, very comfortable. And I can get the dogs right here, each paw. It's beautiful. I love this station so much. Just make sure you don't give him too much luck so that way he don't try to jump out and hang on this thing and get tangled up. Make sure I adjust these straps so that way they don't jump out. I know if I didn't have those straps, he would have been jumped out already. Then, oh! <laughs> okay, I get shower too. Don't shake next time, okay? Okay, we can pause it, look at that. Clip it in. I have big shampoo, but if you had smaller shampoo, you can stick it into here. Then we're gonna shampoo him really nicely. And then we're gonna shampoo him so good. <laughs> Gus is jealous. Gus, are you jealous? <laughs> Gus, oh, this is what I'm talking about. You see, you gotta be careful. Good thing I'm stone and I can adjust myself and catch him before he hurts himself. So make sure you adjust all the straps so that way he don't even have space to get out. And once he get used to it, then you can give him a little bit more slack. So that way he's not going to try to jump out. Give me your paw, give me your paw. Good boy, good boy. I don't mind to get in with them and get some shampoo on me, clean myself up too. But wow, look at that. I'm standing full on. I'm six, seven. Can you believe it? This is large. I know it's gonna work for everybody as well. I'm so sick of cleaning dogs and bending over. It's so uncomfortable. And they always trying to run away from you. With this right here, look at that. He loves it. He's not trying to escape from me because he can't. Good boy. The head I probably just wipe it off with a wet towel because I don't want to traumatize him. Especially while, while we're learning. You see, I can walk around. And now just wash his other side. Good boy, good boy. They are so muddy, so muddy. He's a sponge. Gotta get your tail. I think he's done. Now we just need to rinse him off. Good boy, good boy. I love this prayer. This is insane. Ah! <laughs> Again. You gotta watch out for that kind of stuff and you gotta teach him. I it's think okay, booze. you gotta watch out for things like that and teach him and maybe adjust this even a little bit tighter. But again, you don't wanna get it too tight. You wanna have him some slack. Look at that. He has slack. Good boy, just you know, just talk to him, tell him, teach him, it's okay. Good boy. Good boy. I love this prayer. Check this out. It goes to and penetrates the fur so well. Gets all the shampoo out. This is good. 
good boy. And you can obviously help it. Looks like the drain works really well. It doesn't overspill or anything. And guess what? I'm not standing in the puddle. It diverts the water. Stay. Stay. Wow, that was a good one. That was a good one. Anyway. I'm going to turn it off. Clip it in. And I'm actually going to take him off carefully. Alright, go, dry yourself out. <laughs> you go! Oh. Look how happy they get. <laughs> oh my gosh, gosh, they run so much. <laughs> They're gonna get so muddy instantly. They're so funny. <laughs> I think they were jealous, now they're finally getting them back. <laughs> Look at Gus, he's so big now. Yep, there he goes into the mud. Ooh. Okay, this is nice. Good boy. Good boy, I'll let you smell everything. Do you like your new bath? Do you like this better or do you like this spa better? Good boy. Gus, stop it. Leave him alone. Okay. This is just water. I'll let you drink it if you want. Okay, it's water. Don't freak out at me. Oh yeah, you like this one? I think he loves it. He don't mind. But at all. Again, look how easy it is. I don't have to be bent over at all. Shampoo him doesn't take too long at all. Look how white he gets as soon as you this put the shampoo. This dirty elbow. Oh, you have the dirty elbow. I don't think you can fix that. It'll like come off after a while. He's the most patient dog. He's so tiny when you wet. Look at it. You're all fur and muscle. Look at that soap coming out. I love this sprayer so much. Wow, so much whiter. You see, there's some yellow, but mostly white. Okay, good. Honestly, so far, this is my favorite wash station. I'm actually enjoying this. I can stay comfortably, and when I'm comfortable, the dogs can sense it, so they stay comfortable as well, because I'm not being like all unnecessary movements and stuff. So that way they can actually enjoy the, their bath a lot better. Washing your dog consistently is important. <laughs> ah, because you wash yourself at the same time. But no, because they just shed and your house is going to stay cleaner. And they're going to have less ticks and all this bad stuff in their fur. They're just going to be overall much, much happier dogs. Okay, go. <laughs> I love how they start running <laughs> after like a shower. They just take off. <laughs> Anyways guys, subscribe to my Patreon, I'll be posting some cool stuff over there, links in description. Let me know in comments below, what do you think about this best station? Honestly, it's my favorite for sure, because it's very comfortable for me. I don't have to be bent over the whole time, which is my biggest problem every time I watch the dogs. It was actually easy and fast and fun. So, thumbs up for me. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.